Today on this Day at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make Mexican street corn soup. I'm taking all of the flavors you love from Mexican street corn and adding them into a soup that's easy to make and super delicious. We're gonna start over on the stove by heating up a large pot over medium high heat. Start by melting four tablespoons of butter. Once that's all melted, add in a diced white onion and one minced jalapeno. And then give this all a stir. Let this saute until the onions are soft and translucent, which will take about five minutes. Then add in five cloves of crushed garlic and let this cook for about a minute. We're really just giving the garlic a flash of heat so it has a chance to release its flavor. Then, We'll add in two teaspoons of ground cumin and a teaspoon of chili powder and three tablespoons of all-purpose flour and stir this in. The heat on the spices will cause them to release their oil and in doing so release a lot of their flavor as well. The flour will act as a thickening agent. So you give this just about a minute or two and then we'll pour in four cups of chicken broth. Stir this all in and bring it to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, add in a tablespoon of sugar, two teaspoons of salt, and then six cups of frozen corn kernels. And stir this in. The frozen corn will cool off your mixture pretty quickly, so bring it back to a boil and then reduce the heat to medium low and let it simmer for about five minutes. After five minutes, we'll turn the heat off and then we'll stir in one and a half cups of heavy cream and a cup of freshly chopped cilantro. And stir that all in. The cream will cool off the soup just a little bit, which is perfect because we are ready to ladle this into some bowls and eat. Just before serving, garnish your soup with a little bit of sliced jalapeno, some crumbled cooked bacon, and some crumbled cotija cheese. Do not skip the toppings on this soup because they are what makes this soup really shine. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe and check out the rest of my channel where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.